Hey friends, I'm Andrea and welcome to Morning Coffee. When it comes to our goals, we want to know the specific steps we need to take in order to achieve them. Although it sounds easy enough, we all know that it takes persistence and very hard work to materialize what our heart's desires may be. I get emails all the time about goal setting and how I go about me reaching for the stars. And to tell you the truth, it's a little easier than you think. I usually take aggressive action when I know what I want, but before I put tons of energy in trying to bring something to fruition, I first ask myself a couple of questions to make sure my heart and intentions are completely aligned. You're probably asking, what do you mean by that? Hmm, you know when your mind says one thing and your heart says another? Yep, that's what I'm referring to. And since we have no time to waste, it's important to know what we want and why we want it. And once those questions are answered, it's time to make a plan. Number one, you want to speak them into existence. I'm a huge believer in speaking our wants and desires into existence. There's something about the power of our word and declaring our intentions out loud. I not only say what I want out loud, I also write it down. I like to dream big and when I write it down, I'm able to digest what I truly want. And when you see it in writing, it further makes you accountable because you'll have a daily reminder on your intentions. So speaking your goals and writing them down is very powerful. Number two, be realistic. I always tell my clients to dream big, but to have a healthy dose of reality to go with it. In order for a goal to be attainable, there has to be an understanding on how to achieve the end result. So creating actionable, realistic steps to move closer to your goal is the most pragmatic way to do so. You can't just wish something into existence. You have to do the work and plan on how to get there. Number three, learn from others. This sounds easy enough, but when I set my mind to a specific goal, I do a ton of research as to who has achieved what I envision. Look up their strategies, look at their journey, and get insight on what they have accomplished and how they went by it. So although everybody's path is very different, having something to reference to is a good starting point to wrap your head around what may be needed to take the next step. And number four, accountability buddy. <laughs> now that you have your goals written down and have created a realistic plan around it, it's time to get an accountability buddy. I have an accountability buddy, her name is Amber, <laughs> who helps me through everything. We Skype, we text, and even Snapchat to make sure I'm staying on target. In order for this to work, you must surround yourself with people who believe in you and want to see the best version of you succeed. So listen, believe me, it's not as easy as it sounds. I wouldn't suggest telling everyone you know about your heart's desire because not everybody's going to get it and that's okay. You need to be selective about who you want to speak to regarding what you want to achieve and only share with those who are committed to helping you see your end goal through. So I would love to hear those suggestions that you all may have and what helps you push forward. So remember to comment below and let me know your thoughts and remember to subscribe to my blog with guts and grace. Anything is possible.